Hi. And we're back. Way. Yeah. stuck in a chair, and Just we're talk. almost dead. Look, look, you look too, Captain. Jeez. What are we looking for again? A way to get under the chair. Because I can, the, I can set room. stuff under. I, I, I wish this uh, this system had some way to take ten. Uh, Scoozle. Mm -hmm. Make a sign science test. All right. While you're sitting in the chair. Oh, is the chair okay. gonna make you insane? The thing is back, and it's outside. Ah, <sighs> really though? Ten, just ten minutes. Oh, he's not even by the door this time. So I wouldn't even be able to compel him because I can't see him. Correct, you cannot see him. Uh, the the building begins to shake a bit. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, he's a real asshole about it. Can you use your big gun and shoot the thing, Ethan? Uh, are there I any windows I, that we I, can see him? There are yeah, not. Windows. There are no windows. Like I've got a like, like. Yeah, there was a big door in the front which was yeah. blown off at some point. It's just wide open there, and that's that's it. So I'd have, like my turn would be walking to the door. Um. Yeah. I guess. I'll, uh, uh, everybody else, keep looking. Scoozle, do you have any idea of how how good this entity would be at sensing other things happening on the planet? Uh, I know it's a powerful psychic. So. I will. Uh, I will tell you. Yes. <coughs> okay. Yeah, tell the ship to stop just blowing the planet up. Basically, but, but not where we are. Exactly. Yeah. Like just miles away. Mm-hmm. Miles and miles away. So, yes, I would like the ship to start bombarding the surface, but uh, preferably... Very far away from where we are? Yeah. Or where they assume we are. Uh, if it if its weapons even work at this moment. Yeah, if its weapons even work. Uh, we, I think we have weapons that don't not work. Uh, yeah, you have, you have a weapon that cannot become unpowered, that's correct. So, yes. Uh... Please tell them to do that. All right, I will send the message, and okay. I will, uh, like, move towards the door. Okay. Uh, what what your ship does is uh, they give an order to just rotate, so they're aiming far, far, far north of where they think you guys were, and they just mm -hmm. start cutting loose onto the planet. Um, Scoozle, uh, the the. Building stops shaking and this thing disappears. Okay. Uh, okay. Well. Uh, keep looking. Yeah, keep looking because we gotta find uh, something here. Do, like going outside, I think is just suicide. So our yeah. our existence currently is within this sphere. Oh, there's a button for my heightened senses applying. Uh, it the? didn't help though. <laughs> Where's the other guy? Nearly! <gasps> 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 fuck! Well, he succeeded. He just didn't get. Him. Well, I succeeded. It wasn't yeah, good he hasn't. Oh. He hasn't found anything. Uh, Jesus. Uh. Hmm. Like he's under the Can chair. I just blow a hole in the floor. But why? Like, why? Also, with what? Might be something under there. Cause his gun's really good at shooting under the floor. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's got good penetration. It could just blast a hole. You could try. Mm. I could also try talking everything? to Grunty to see if his tech use skill is of any use to us. Sure. this room. That's obviously yeah. tech. Uh, this thing is strong enough that you could directly project an image into his mind of what yeah. you see around him. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. yeah. Directly project an image of the room. Sure. That. Fuck, it, it, so. To Fuck him, it seems deeply. like I am screaming. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. Well, would you ask Grunty what he sees? Uh, yeah, he tells you you have to get out of the chair, and there's uh, a panel on the side that should open up a little like ladder on the side that'll go down somewhere. Okay. How is it he knows I'll how do to that. do the brain chair, but not the ice pod <laughs> or the coffee maker? 
<laughs> oh my god. Alright, well, I'll get out of the chair and then touch the panel. Okay. Uh, yeah, you open it up and a ladder opens up into a underground cave sort of area below it. And there's this big... Uh, wait, where... Me, me first. Me first down ladder. Okay. Me. There's a big sort of glowing crystal thing underground there. Yep. Uh, Scoozle, you sense that this is definitely whatever is blocking the psychic uh, abilities in this area. But it seems that uh, it's got some electronics hooked up to it. It seems they've somehow used it to sort of reverse its power, and that's what's amplifying all the psychic abilities coming from that chair. All right, so I guess we're going down the ladder. So you look at this crystal. It's a it's a jammy crystal that they've hooked up and made it so it amplifies power. So if we bust it, good or bad. It's sort of uh, it, it it's kind of sucking in all the psychic power from the area and then outputting it back up so. through the chair and into the uh, into the dish reflector up top. And I, I know that this entity is the psychic existence of this area, basically. That's what you're suspecting. So presumably destroying this crystal destroys it. I've got the, like, knowledge Eldar thing, so should I roll for that maybe? See if I can figure this out? Like, I know what the uh, thing is, yeah, though, but yeah, go like, ahead, I don't you know, can, like... You can roll. Yep, uh, yeah, go ahead, Ethan. This first characteristic intelligence. Nope. You have no idea what it would do. Well, my two. Uh, what do you think, Brain Boy? <laughs> you could always fake point it, too. Am I Brain Boy? I could nah. always fake point it. I'm, I'm Brain Boy in this regard. Uh, You're never Brain Boy. I could evaluate it. <laughs> how, how much is it worth? <laughs> how much is it worth? <laughs> that's, I feel like that's a valuable question. Uh... Which, uh you you actually think it's probably pretty invaluable considering what it does. So, it, I, I mean, this is, this is worth a ton. Just because just because we're about to die, does not <laughs> mean we should pass up a good business opportunity. You're right. Like I'm mad as heck. Uh, um. So I guess what we could try to do first is disconnect all of the machinery from this crystal. But hang on. So. But that's not as explosive or fun as smashing it. So you think so? So the crystal is drawing in, in the psychic energy and then yeah. outputting it through the chair. But what the entity? So what's that then? I, my experience with it was that it is the psychic energy of this area. But that's being drawn into this thing. What? How can an area have psychic energy? <laughs> well, the warp's crazy. No, it's not. That's this one's not the warp. If, if that was drawn in the psychic energy, how come it didn't come in here? Exactly, because it's it does the jamming thing. So uh, can't we use it to jam it and get back to our ship and then leave? No, uh, the reason why it couldn't come in is the area around the chair had the psychic. Yeah, it's got the jammers. jamming thing on. So this is going to be the decision: do we smash this and it's good, or do we smash this and it's bad? Or I guess we could just unplug the bits, but then we've got to plug them back in, and our tech guy is sort of... Because if we unplug the bits, we can't use the amplifying thing, so Scoozle's mm -hmm. not going to be Mega Brain Boy anymore. How Can we even move this crystal to begin with? Can you move it? It's big. I mean, it's, really it's yeah. like attached to the ground. Yeah. It's in the ground a bit here. So. Yeah, but I mean, dude, could you you're break talking, off you're a talking piece, maybe. You're talking to someone who owns a mining planet. <laughs> <laughs> Bit of a stretch. So you, it's got, you it's own got, a planet. It's a planet with a drill on it. Yeah. There's bit, there's evidence of it having been mined. Uh, who wants to poke it with a stick? Uh, uh, Not it. Uh, Icarus does. Yeah, he loves to throw rocks at things. It. Have you yeah, a but, idiot? but, uh, I mean, uh, so Holt can't because he it's, it's, might, he might get brain fried and that's no good. Um, throw a rock at it. Anodar it's can't. Like all the time be, as well, so I can't do it either. Just poke it already. Throw a rock at it. 
I don't have a rock. You for it's kick probably, rock. Uh, poked it. Is there any rocks in this shitty room that's full of crystals? It's a cave. Yeah, there's rocks. Yeah, you yeah. Pick up yeah, a rock. Just go poke right, it. Pick up a rock and throw it at it then. Okay. Uh, you throw it at it, uh, and the rock bounces off, and the crystal starts vibrating. Scoozle, you can feel an immense buildup of psychic energy, and then uh, it all is released all at once, and you're all knocked down. Why did you do that? <laughs> Why did you throw a rock at it? Don't! Don't uh, touch things! I'm never coming down to a planet for you guys again. Uh, so, you're oh. coming down to. Yeah, you're right. You're coming down with the first two teams. <laughs> Really? Um, at this point, I'm pretty sure that this crystal is upset that uh, people came and uh, attached machinery to it to try and draw its psychic power. You, th you think? Because because it, it's reacting violently towards things. You think that's how we get? You think we're gonna get out of this by help that's like something. the thorn from the lion's paw, or whatever <laughs> story is you humans have? Well. We saw what happened when a rock was thrown at it. What's going to happen when we shoot? Yeah, like, the... like, like that's what I'm thinking. I'm like, I've got this gun and it's really good, but I also don't want to have a crystal explode into a thousand shards and kill me. Yeah, let's unplug it then, gently. Just leave. Let's make cooing noises at it. And go, oh, calm down, baby. There's Next a... time we get down on a planet, we should bring explosives. Well, yeah, like, <laughs> Grunny's got uh, it. You, you can use them. You have explosives. They're just on your shuttle. Yeah, you, you don't carry them with you all the time. Yeah, have them right. I, I don't yeah, dare go outside. Yeah, let's unplug this stupid thing. Fine. Okay. Uh, someone make a tech use, or just start ripping shit out of it. Uh, can't we can talk to Grunty again? Not anymore. Uh, he's not in the chair. Yeah, he's not in the chair. Ah, uh, and then he can't. But get back up in the chair There's then. Can't see in the room. We don't have enough mirrors <laughs> for a periscope. So you, <sighs> hang on, how many wires are connected to this thing? Uh, it's got a bunch. Yeah, it's it's hooked up in a bunch of different places. Okay, different ways. so go at, up as Grunty if it matters in which order order we tear uh, unplug these wires or not. And if it does, well, we're screwed, and if it doesn't, good. Hey, Brain Guy, can you just, like, transmit psychically? Uh, what to do? No, just, like... Can you talk to the thing? Yeah, so like, just, just yell really loud in your I, I, brain. I uh, guess I can use a sign of science next just, to this crystal and see what the result is. Just, like, yell in your... T uh, Scoozle, you're getting basically nothing. This this crystal's still sucking all the psychic power out of the area. Yeah, get in the okay. chair, do a telepathy yell, and, like, do the feeling that you really want to help. Like don't okay. don't um, do what don't do words because it ain't gonna get it. I'll climb up, ladder, sit okay. back in the chair. Is that possible still? Uh yeah yeah you didn't okay. like move the chair you opened something on the ground next to it. Okay. Well, the, oh. Like do like help and freedom. Do that one. All right. Well, I, I'll broadcast that we're trying to help in this general area. Okay. Uh. The uh, the only thing that you notice happen is that the uh, thing shows up again outside. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to the door and yell in Eldar at it. I'm gonna yell. We're gonna <coughs> the the wires that these awful uh, monkey have done to you. I'm like I know like. Could, would you let us live if we helped you out and made you not have all these cables? Uh, Ethan, you? make a... Uh, what is it? Sense motive. Sense, sense, sense motive. motive. No, is there... Uh, scrutiny, I guess, is what it is. Yeah. Or... Three, oh. And I get plus ten. No, I don't, because I'm not looking at a thing, I guess. Okay, you, are you... Are you looking at it, or are you... Yeah. I'm looking okay. at it. Like, I put okay. my head around the corner. So, is that one degree of success? Yep. Yeah, okay. Uh, it seems happy about that idea, but you don't think it's for a good reason for you. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was worried about. Uh, All right. 
<sighs> so that means smashing the crystal is almost assuredly bad for us. Well, unplugging the crystal is uh, bad. It liked the it, it really liked the idea of unplugging the crystal, but I don't like the idea of unplugging the crystal. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna poke my head around and go. Oh, we could just smash it, I guess. Uh, make another scrutiny test. Uh. Uh. Please succeed. Oh. Uh, you can't tell what it's thinking. Stupid thing. Uh, Ethan, the building starts shaking again. Uh, well, uh, uh. Do I have? I don't think I start with. Are you the only one upstairs? Oh no! Uh, yeah, I'm up here in the chair. But you're in the chair, Ethan. Make a yeah. dodge test. Yeah, I'm good at that. I hope. Oh, four above. Uh, I think I might fate point. No, um, yeah, I'm gonna fate point that because I don't want to have a thing fall on me and kill me. Okay. How do I spend fate point? Uh, and just use character fate actions. Point. Where's that? Oh yeah, use fate point. Use fate point. Well, uh, uh, dodge. Nope. Okay. Uh, you are hit by part of the ceiling falling down. Uh, uh. you have four armor though. Yep. Yeah, you don't take any damage. Because <sighs> it wasn't very big, this okay. time. I'm gonna go down the ladder. Uh, I'm gonna look. In the, where's the Where's the book? Like, I don't think I start with grenades. I think that's. I think that's a fancier boy than me. Uh, uh, uh. We could just shoot the shit out of it. Yeah, like, we could just shoot the shit out of it and, like, fall down and have a bad time. Uh, race against the wall and shoot it. I mean, we've got a lot of really good... We've got a lot of really good guns here that could do a lot of things to it. Uh, da -da -da -da. It's like, I feel like, I feel like there aren't... We don't have that many options left. Mm-hmm. So... Uh, do something quick, the building's falling apart. How about yeah. we just open fire on the thing, everyone, and see what happens? Yeah, I'm because gonna, at this point... I'm going to stand against the wall, so I, I'll get pushed into the wall and not go flying, and I'm just going to go full auto on this thing. I'm going, so, going to disconnect from the chair. Yeah, okay. you should probably... <laughs> <laughs> Before you guys... I probably, I probably, me. I probably mentioned that, like, the chair, maybe, whatever, brain boy. <laughs> Okay, so uh, well, all three three of you are shooting at the crystal. Apparently, yes. yep. All right, well, it's not moving, so everyone just roll damage for your weapons. I don't know what the, the damage is for my bolt gun. Hey. You should use the other one. Yeah, the good one. You should definitely use good. the other one. I don't know what the damage for that is here. Let me find it. It's it's really good. Uh, uh, for your yeah. Your Inferno Pistol is 2d10 plus 8. Oh, 2d10. Where's my gun? I guess I'm only shooting it once then. <laughs> wanted to shoot it a lot. Uh, split a rifle. 1d10 plus 2. If I'm only, if I'm only shooting it once. Shoot, shoot it in the head. Crystal bit. But I'm shooting it while I'm like holding the trigger down, shooting the hell out of this awful thing. Okay, uh, that's a lot of damage. Okay, uh, so what happens is you're all flung back into the wall and the crystal shatters and breaks apart. It blows the top out of the cave, it smashes that chair and blows a hole in the roof of the building. Uh, this, the, the thing outside has disappeared. Alright. 
Uh, what How's the, the weather looking? Let me get up here. Is everything shaking still? Uh, everything's still shaking. You think the building's about to fall apart? Yeah, second. let's uh, let's leave. Yeah, I'm gonna do that sprint thing where I can move like forty-eight, and I'm gonna move not even twenty-four. So I guess I'll just run normally. But it looks really cool. Okay, so you guys run out of there. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, you run outside and the building collapses. Um, the thing reappears, but it's kind of like flickering, like it's not completely there. Uh, what are you doing? Shoot it! Yep. I'm gonna shoot it. I'm, go I'm also gonna yell at it in order like, I warned ya! Gave you an offer! Fucker! Where's these, where these guns at then? Yeah, so I guess I'm going to shoot it. Yeah, Ethan, go ahead, go first, since you're out there. Shoot it, good. Uh, I'm gonna fall out the hell out of it. So none, it's enormous. Uh, is this short range? Yeah. Yeah, that is short range. Okay, uh, full auto. It's enormous. Yep. Yep. All that looks good. Uh, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> it disappears. What are you doing? Uh, we uh, wish it. I let's run. Towards the yeah, ship. yeah, let's. Yeah. Uh, let's right, go ahead. to the one that's working. Yeah, let's get to the one that's working and smoke discuss the clipper. We'll be home for breakfast. I'm really fast. Well, not so fast I get tired and then fall down. I'm just half as fast. The thing appears in front of you guys again. Uh, it, it's smaller. I wonder it's... if there's another crystal around here we need to destroy as well. <laughs> Probably. Um, I can roll sign the science to see if I can sense another power source like the crystal. Nope, cannot. It's, it, it seems to not be wholly there still. It's still like flickering. It's not doing too well, whatever it is. Uh, you just stopping? I'm gonna shoot it again. Okay. Shoot <coughs> it! Every time this stupid thing gets me, I'm gonna shoot it every time. Click on you. Go ahead. It disappears again. Okay. Let's go. D -d 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 this is the one that everybody, like, the, the guy who doesn't know shit about cars thought it was good, and the guy who does know about cars thought it was good. Which is better mm -hmm. than the one that we stopped know working, yeah. Uh, you guys get in the ship? Okay, yep. who's, who's piloting? Well, uh, I'll pilot because I have the skill to pilot, at least. So do I. Oh, do you? Mm-hmm. Do you want a co-pilot? Uh, what is your agility, then? Because whoever's best should do it. Uh, you're slightly 41. better than me. Yeah, okay. So, Kenora's piloting. Okay. Uh, nice. You guys start to take off. Uh, it appears behind the ship and starts psychically crushing it. Oh, I'm gonna shoot it some more. <laughs> no, you can't. You're in the ship unless you, like, get out. Yeah. Kenora, make a pilot... Uh, whatever your pilot skill is, test. <laughs> Hmm. Can, can we can we open the back? I'm and gonna. And I shoot. While he's going into space. We, well, well, while we're like trying to get going. Oh. Um, I'm gonna pilot better than that. No, I'm not. Uh, You're gonna pilot so you could, if, if you want to push him out of the way and try to pilot the ship, <laughs> you can. Right now, it's not going anywhere. It's being held in place, and the walls are bulging in towards you. Um, can I see him from? Like, do we have a window that can see him? Uh, only if you go to the back of the shuttle and like. You try need to, to be touching the thing. Yeah, like we're gonna if we're opening it and leaving now, I'm shooting it. Yeah, I, I was gonna try and compel it to get it to stop. If no. you'd rather do that, go ahead. I think you're probably you do better it. off doing the the other thing because you're not in Cause, the chair. Well, c yeah, because my pilot's at a half, so I do agility. Half Your pilot's agility, at so. a half. Where did you yeah. learn to fly? Yeah. So Where did you learn to fly? 
that's a 20% chance to succeed here, or I could take my luck with Compel. Well, you did Compel it that one time when you weren't in the chair. Yeah. Make up mine pretty quick. It is flickering. I will Compel. Uh, let me get rid of this power modifier so I don't cheat. Um, give me one second to see what I'm replacing. Uh, that's fine. It's too intense. Right, Five there's degrees my... of success. Yeah. Well, I'm glad we made it to the boat before we went last. Still to holding run. the ship. Kanor, Kanor, you can try another roll now. Okay. It's been gonna, another turn. I'm going to shoot it. Uh, am I able to open the back or not? The, the, the back's open right yeah, now. Yeah, the back's okay, open. it's open. Nice. Ethan, you can try shooting it if you want while Kanor does this. <laughs> hey, buddy. How about... Uh... Kanor, you, you, you overloaded one of the engines. It's going to be at least one turn before you can try again. Uh... Ethan, whatever you're doing, go for it. Yeah, I did it, but I didn't click on him to do the thing, but I did a lot of shit. Uh, here. It disappears. Uh, alright, well, it's been a few seconds, so, Kanor, you can go ahead, try again if you're gonna try to pilot. Have you tried turning, like, the handbrake? I'm not this bad at pilot! <laughs> <laughs> this is worse than playing Blood Bowl. You, you wanna, you wanna fake that, maybe? Fine, I'll fade it. Now I know why you were yelling at people to do it better. <laughs> is this, this is the fifth Can I yell at him to do it better? Set? You could. I don't know, that's, it'll help. That's roll. Okay, I'm gonna wait to pilot and see Brill to yell at me then. <laughs> I, I guess that'd be a command. It doesn't it, do anything. Do yeah, it, it, won't, it won't do anything for IB, but you can just yell. <laughs> uh, I could try scaring him. <laughs> I'm really good at the intimidate. Okay, here we go. Well, you succeeded at least. Yeah. Okay, you take off. Congratulations, you're flying through the storm. Uh, Can we close the back door now? Yeah, you you close the back door. Uh, Kanor, you make it safely out of the clouds if this is below fifty. Good. Yes. Ah, the, clouds. the coin toss. <laughs> Congratulations. All right, so you fly back up to the ship. Yep. Uh, uh, you guys I'm yelling as we get out. Just go, 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 go. Leave. We're uh, leaving. You guys dock, uh, mm -hmm. and you're back on the ship now. Okay, what's the status of the ship? I... Uh, when you get back there, everything seems to be completely powered up. So we're going to... I'm going to the ship map. Let's, let's leave some boys here that, that say... Uh... Don't go anywhere near this planet, ever. Or let's get a bit further a away first. Let's get yeah. a bit further away. We'll Am I the only one who's, who want to keep spite bombarding this no, planet? No, we don't. Do, no, we'll, we'll do business talk once we're safely out of this shithole. I can't, I can't believe you don't want to bombard this. Oh, oh no, I'm, well, I got business, Captain. Don't worry. It's it's a tradition now. <laughs> it's no, it's no. not a tradition until you do it twice. We've done it twice. I just wasn't on the ship the second time around. Let's, let's pull away from this stupid place, and then we'll talk is, business. In Captain. the medical medical supplies, is there anything to sedate uh, <laughs> someone? Please, Captain. Of course. I've got a really good business opportunity to get us out of here. Let's leave. Let's go towards uh, Ritam Ritaminaron. Ritaminaron. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Anywhere that isn't here. All right. Well, let's. It's time for your pilot, uh, your warp, uh, your your navigator to. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Barbara. Okay. Uh, are are you guys are you guys doing your normal preparations, or are you just rushing her to get out of here? Um, I think at this point we'd probably be rushing because yeah. of what we just went through. Yeah. Okay. It's still a little bit of a rush. Okay. Here we go. Just get uh, us out here, and then we'll work on getting somewhere where we want to. She's bothering to check how long it's going to take, but she's taking a quick uh, look to plot the course. Hang on. Okay. Uh, she found the Astronomicon. Uh, the 
course doesn't look too good. It's going to take you a long while to get there. The warp's really weird around this planet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. aware. New. Okay, so, uh... She makes it into the warp. You guys are way off course. Holy shit. <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, as long, Whoa. as long as we're not in this awful place anymore. We come back at rain. I'm not sure that's true. Uh, Holy shit. Okay. Um, Did we just die? No, you didn't die. What happens is you guys take about two months in the warp. Oh, that gives us time it's to heal up. Long, long <laughs> time. <laughs> time to convalesce. Uh, and maybe open up one of the cans. I mean, uh, cry frozen uh, uh, people. Maybe Grunty will be ready to come out of that's, his workshop. That's two months with your fast, fast ship, too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, real time, it's been uh, about half a year. Holy moly. No worry. No one. So I will move. No one's going to do business with that planet. We're good, Captain. We, we probably I, should have sent a message about rain before we we disappeared for half a no year. No one's going to go there in no. half a year anyway. And if they do, whatever. They ain't getting out. They're not as cool as us. Okay. Uh, we can erase this stuff. We'll put in your. Your new warp course, and we're going to note that it's a long, not very good warp travel course. Uh, okay, so you guys map. are at Ritter Moran. Oh, we made it! Yeah, yeah even made being it. super off course. Not what I wanted to do. We sort of went, I bet we went a, like a really long way. We went like near iniquity and then turned around and came back. <laughs> well, we made it. We did it. You know we, what? We, we succeeded in not dying. Yeah, I was gonna say, I was gonna be like, whoa, we did it, but what have we done? We've. Well, we've done is we've we destroyed a crystal. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, Don't we'll worry, I've got, I got business there. opportunity, Captain. Don't worry. Where? You keep saying that. Yeah. Do you want to elaborate at all? Well, yeah, in private. Right in front of all the crew. <laughs> so you guys come out of warp around Ritamaran. And uh, if you go look at the ship, oh. the ship map, uh, in the sky here, when you guys arrive, there is a very strange looking ship. Uh, but there, this is. It's a medieval this, planet. Yeah, exactly. Why yeah, well, maybe here? someone's here doing some prime someone, directive someone, shit. Someone's here. There's a very strange ship. That is mm -hmm. weird. And I think we can stop there. Ah. Yeah. Oh, look at all these astropaths. <laughs> yep. Where, where's the med bay? My I want to be in the uh, med bay. Yeah, hold on. Uh, I, will, I will put you guys on the actual ship here. It will but, feel much better. You know what will make us feel even better? Saying goodbye to YouTube. Bye, goodbye, YouTube. YouTube. Bye, 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 Y